The American Society of Agricultural and Biological Engineers 11th Historic Landmark designation was made in 1976 in recognition of the New Holland baler. The stationary baler or hay press was invented in the 1850s but did not become popular until the 1870s. By 1930, pickup balers like this one from the Ann Arbor Machine Company had been introduced, but most of the bale compression and all of the tying had to be done by three to four man crews which rode the baler. How to automatically bind the compressed bales seemed to baffle the designers until in 1936 an enterprising Lancaster County, Pennsylvania farmer set out to provide a design that worked. Using parts from other balers, a wood saw, grain combines and tractors, plus other parts he designed and constructed himself, he cobbled up a machine which was field tested the next harvest season. It worked. But the 1937 baler was slow and the bales were loose because they weren't tied under compression. The next year, he refined the machine sufficiently to permit tying the bales under compression. Arthur Young, who owned a machine shop in nearby Kinzer, Pennsylvania, helped build five balers in 1938. In 1940, an agreement was reached with the New Holland Machine Company to build the automatic baler at its New Holland, Pennsylvania plant. This product reestablished the company as a leader in agricultural equipment. The use of a pickup baler required no major changes as to farming practices or in other hay harvesting equipment and because of its labor saving features was readily accepted by the majority of farmers. Design work resulted in the introduction of the New Holland Model 77 automatic baler in 1949. A smaller version, Model 66, followed three years later. By the late 1960s, 80 to 85 percent of all forage harvested and stored as hay was harvested with pickup balers. By that time, there were 750,000 balers on U.S. farms. While the name of the Lancaster County farmer is known to some, it is not widely recognized, and that is according to his preference. As a loyal Mennonite, his faith precluded his achieving accolades or financial gain from his work. Thus, in recognizing the site where the New Holland Baler was first developed, ASABE acknowledges the contributions of this farmer and the firm that applied its engineering talent to bring his dream to reality. The New Holland Baler plaque is located at the CNH Manufacturing Facility at 300 Diller Avenue, New Holland, Pennsylvania.